for my mini reading today for those of you um, that are seeing me for the first time. There's a reason. This is just a positive love and confirmation. You have guides, angels, higher power. They're around you, guiding and protecting you. Um, and want to just let you know that they are around you, supporting you. So um, it doesn't have to be the whole message. This is a shorter version I'm doing today. There'll be no healing at the end. Um, so I'm just going to get the messages and just give them to you today. So it's 18, 14, 20, 30, 38, 6, and 2. Scorpio, astrology sign, does not have to be your sun sign. It could be anywhere in your birth chart, or someone you're dealing with, someone who's crossed over. Sag, Aquarius, Libra, Capricorn, Aries. The initials are, you know, something about the sun. I'm hearing the sun, the sun, the sun. Uh, could be the sun card. I'm not sure what card that is. Sorry, my dog is going crazy in the background. Uh, I can't remember what number it is, and I apologize for that. It's in the tarot. You guys will know who this is in reference to. Oh, interesting. Um, uh, so 19. It's 19. I don't know. Sun and Leo. I guess I forgot that. Okay. Um, sun. There's definitely importance of the sun. Sun and moon energy. Finances. K-R- C, D, E, V, Q. Okay, they'll resonate with who they need to. Um, definitely about the sun and the moon. Pulling in the, both energies important to bring you balance. It's a, a male and female energy brings you balance to be able to receive, be able to give, it's give and take. Someone needs to learn how to give and take. Um, the sun is very healing. The moon, the sun is masculine. The moon is feminine. A lot of duality is what's coming through. It, uh, it's important to stay true to yourself of who you are. Do the healing work. It's going to bring you lots of closure so that this new beginning that you're going to be having is going to come in. It's going to be beautiful. It's just going to take a little bit longer. Trust in it. Trust and have faith that we're around you. Things happen in divine timing. Trust it. I'm seeing the web. I'm seeing the tree of life and the web. And again, a Celtic. Um, something with the Celtic is coming through. I can't remember what that's called. Um, but it, it, it intertwines. I'm kind of seeing it like a tree of life type thing. Um, so keep doing the work. Use the Celtic cross. When you're doing the tarot, shortens it. I, I'm not sure. That's for somebody who's doing that work. Um, something about the rainbows. Um, someone's going to be flying. So you're going to be taking a trip. You're going to do lots of flying, lots of trips. I'm getting lots of movement, lots of um, traveling. With your work. Whatever the new is be coming in, it's going to be um, more work. It's going to be good. 
allowed to come in. Okay, um, sunflower, I'm seeing sunflowers. They always point to the sun. So yeah, there's definitely, it's a Leo energy. It's, it's definitely sun, the sun healing energy. It's a combination of things. There's several mean, meanings with that. You have the strength. Um, it's healing. Get out in it more. Go with nature. Stop being stagnant. That's what I keep hearing. Okay. Leave a comment. That's how all this positivity spreads. And remember, I am going to be doing a Zoom spiritual session. And that's its healings and its messages, whatever my collective group needs at that moment. That's what's going to happen the first time uh, the Zoom meeting is free. After that, there will be a fee. It's going to be Tuesday, November 28th and Wednesday, November 29th. Tuesday will be night. Wednesday will be day. Leave a comment that's how all this positivity spreads. Love and blessings and keep on sparkling.